What's up, guys? Welcome back. Who are you? Hey, guys, I'm Sam. I don't know if that's her actual real name. This is Philip. <laughs> Samantha is her real name because she just called me Philip. So let's clarify that one. And Getting so, formal today. Yeah, clearly we're um, very formal individuals when we do our requests from <laughs> Joseph. Clearly, we're in a mood today. <laughs> Anyways, I was just guys. Telling, telling Phil this is the look he gives me when he's angry at me. Has the uh, album cover here. <laughs> no, actually, that's the look when she says something ridiculous. That's my response from <laughs> Billy Squire. He's got the look down, Pat. And um, we're doing Lonely is the Night today. Like I said, a request from Joseph. Thank you so much for the, for the paid request. Yes, really you, do Joseph. appreciate it. All jokes aside, we appreciate and are really grateful for all the love that you guys have shown us on yes. the channel. We wouldn't be where we are today without you. So this is a cha your channel as much as it is our channel. And uh, you do not know anything about Billy Squire, correct? I do not. All right. I don't know much about him either. And uh, that would be a lie because I actually know nothing about him. So <laughs> saying I don't know much about him is kind of pushing it. And so this is going to be our first introduction to him. Lonely is the night. We got a little pop quiz question for you before we start. Samantha, what is it? Well, we were going to ask you what album this is from, but since the album cover is on the screen, I don't know if that is a really a efficient pop quiz question anymore. Well, this just highlights how I do not uh, take responsibility for the pop quiz questions, because if I had known that, then I wouldn't have set up the pop quiz question. Anyways, <laughs> with that said, we don't have a pop quiz question for you. Let's just get into the song. Are yes, you ready, Samantha? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's go. Okay. When there's no one left to call, you feel the time is right. Uh huh. Say the right is on the wall. Let's get him, Billy. It's a hard time to fight when the walls are closing in. Call it what you like. It's time you got. energy. Let's go. So, Billy's doing his thing. Yeah, he is killing it. I'm loving this. What are you loving about it? I just love the flow of the song. Like, I feel the like it's kind of... The flow, the riff. Yeah, like, it has a really good rhythm. I so like the, the groove. groove. Yeah. Yeah. What, I, you like, what, give, what sets the groove for you in this? Um, I feel like the drums. 
the drums okay like yeah. the kick snare yeah. rhythm that yeah. they have going yeah the guitar too um and i just really enjoy his vocal i feel like it sits in with the song really, really well i really love the high register that he goes into at the end of the hook goes into the back end of the hook and transitions into the next verse you know his, vo- his voice also really offsets the guitar riff well mm-hmm. it's a really heavy riff yeah but his vocal gets a little bit higher yeah yeah, I, it's not, he reminds me of somebody that we've done on the channel, but I can't pinpoint it. Maybe it's The Who that we've done, like his vocal, mm. the lead vocalist from The Who and, okay. and him. Um, anyways, not important because he's got his own flavor from it. It's a very hard rock sound. Yeah. Uh, what are your thoughts on the lyrics? I feel like he's talking a lot about like isolation, challenges that you go through with having to be on your own and overcome that loneliness, even almost like a little bit of touch of like despair of being so lonely. Yeah, but it's 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 about lonely is the night as well, right? So yeah, I don't know. Maybe he's referring to like looking, wanting to be with somebody in the night. Yeah, maybe. I mean, from my experience, loneliness usually hits you the most at night because that is when you are the most alone, right? It's like dark. literally, no, yeah, and like nobody's around there's no pe- just general people around yeah. um like passerby people right like you're everybody else is sleeping so i feel like like most people when they're lonely they feel the loneliest at night yeah and i mean i don't necessarily feel like the lyrics are all that important for this song because yeah. i don't feel like it represents no. what i'm hearing and feeling I about agree. this song like i'm feeling like a lot of energy and a good mm-hmm. vibe and i want to like dance and yeah, you were chair like... dance in there right <laughs> so i don't know if that represents the maybe we're missing the yeah. lyric meaning maybe there's a little deeper meaning as to yeah. lonely is the night what it means and if you guys have some more context there let us know or maybe it's supposed to be a motivational sense of like this song's supposed to bring you out of being lonely yeah true i didn't even think about that anyways let's get back into this fire song from billy swear Let's go. Oh, it's Billy Squire. Lonely is the night. And for me, um, just some added thoughts. I felt like the symbol was so prominent in that mix. It just stuck out so much and it gave you a lot of that energy. Yeah, I was just thinking about in the second half. And the layering, you know, the bass riff with the electric guitar. It was kind of, you know, in the mix, it was underlaid to the electric guitar riff, which I felt like added a nice layer. Um, 
in terms of the messaging, it sounded like he was like a saying in some of those lyrics anyways, like it was kind of motivational in yeah. some sense being like, I'm not going to you know, sit around and watch the TV and yeah. when it's midnight, I'm going to go out and party and enjoy life. That yeah. was kind of the vibe. And he's I was also picking saying up. like, get up and come out with me. Yeah. Type thing. So, yeah. It, cause it does seem like a party song to me in yeah. some sense. So maybe that's what he's highlighting is, you know, Instead you can of sit at home and be lonely, then and get be up lonely and at something. night or you can come out with Billy and have a good time. <laughs> party up. So what were your thoughts on the same? I liked song? it. I thought it was great. I'm sure you guys saw me chair dancing over here all the way. Um, I thought it was good vibes. Like I said, to me, it was more of like a good rhythm, a good groove, uh, get up and kind of like move song. Mm-hmm. I really liked his vocal. I liked the drums. I thought it was great. Yeah. The riff was good. In terms of the sound, it's interesting because it came out in the early 80s, right? And... <clears throat> So in the 80s, we had the evolution of like Van Halen coming to light. And so some of the guitar work sounds representative of what Van Halen might have sounded yeah, like. Yeah, like what was popular at that time. Yeah, with their nice, I really like obviously Eddie's guitar riffs and everything. So um, <clears throat> that aspect, but it also kind of has remnants of the 70s in the late 70s. Mm-hmm. So it's kind of almost like we're in a blend and that would make yeah, sense for the early fusion. 80s yeah. of the transition yeah, of I think the sound. This is what, 81? So. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so, I mean, you know, that could be indicative of, you know, just this song. Maybe he's uh, Billy as a, an artist, but yeah. you guys can tell us because we don't know nothing about Billy. Yeah, educate us. Yeah, but I liked it. I, li- I like this song quite a bit. I'm really into these hard-hitting rock songs. Yeah, I thought this was awesome. Yeah, so if you guys liked it, make sure you hit that like button for us down thumbs below. Up, hit that thumbs, thumbs up. up. See, we just gave you, both of us, gave you two thumbs at the same time. Now we need a third one from you down below. We also need you to hit that notification bell to make sure you don't miss any of our videos if you're already subscribed thank you for all that support really do appreciate it and uh we're going towards 150,000 subscribers get us there come on join us on this wagon because you love music right that's why you're here so uh, we got two videos every single day not just music we got comedy sports and what else samantha some history now that's right so if you like that stuff join us in this journey and we'll see you tomorrow with two more videos thanks for watching guys and we'll see you then